What is going on, y'all? It has been a hectic day. I've been running around town, running errands all day, getting stuff done, but it's about 5.30. We have two hours or so of sunlight left, and I know about approximately zero about bass fishing in this area, but we're gonna make the most of that two hours, and we're gonna get out there and try and catch something that swims. So I just went to the absolute worst Dick Sporting Goods in the world. They didn't have jet crap for fishing supplies, but this is what I managed to wrangle up right here. Freaking dunk that. I bought a bass rod that I know nothing about. Probably wasted my money, whatever. Got some Sankos, got some fluorocarbon line, KV crankbait, no clue what I'm doing. But we're gonna give it a try. I'm gonna probably throw on, I don't know, a Sanko or a jig on one rod and then like a crankbait on another rod. Who knows what I'm gonna do. But uh, I'll see you guys in that next clip and we'll see what's going on. Hopefully I don't fall down this hill. Man, actually it doesn't look half bad. It's kind of deep here. Just kicked a rock in so it spooked any fish that were actually gonna be here. Put my bag down with this expensive camera in it. That's probably smart. Start out with this Sanko. A little eight ounce weight on it. See what we can do. Alright, change of plans. This spot sucks. Next spot, here we go. Right over here, it definitely sounded like a bass. It's funny because I'd cast it there freaking three times and didn't see any movement. God, some of these bass guys. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a freaking bullfrog. No way. Think he'll eat it, y'all? He attacked it. He's way too small to get it. Oh! Let's see where he comes up. Come on, focus on my face. Focus on my face. There you go. Nice. All right. What's up, guys? Uh, yesterday did not pan out. I was only able to fish for about 30 minutes. Didn't check, catch jack crap. But whatever. That lake sucks. That's fishing. And now I have maybe a couple hours to check out this new little pond here. And I'll take you guys along for that. Looks like someone's leaving right now. So they may have already fished it out. Who knows? I'm going to give it a shot and see what I can catch here. Take you guys along for the ride. Wow, it looks like there's a bunch of fish trapped in this little freaking pool right here. I guess when it rains a lot, as you guys can see right here, all the the pond will overflow down into this creek. We almost just got like a natural spring coming out the water right here. This is cool. Let's 
slippery too. Yeah, look at that. Coming right out the ground into this pool. All these little sunfish or something like that. About the size of my lure. Kind of just looks like it dead ends right here. Just had a small one come up and just whack it, just pop, and I set the hook. Sanko came flying back at me. I got too excited. Then I proceeded to almost walk straight into the water with my shoes on, like a dangus. But, you know, quality footage of the day. I just didn't get it on camera right there. Hopefully we can just uh, catch a couple small ones real quick for you guys. Come on, buddy. Clearly a lot of people fish here because there is a uh, pretty prominent trail cut through here. And as soon as I got here, there was two people that had been fishing already. So I bet this place gets a decent amount of pressure. There we go. Oh, he came off. God, there is life in the lake. Took my freaking Sanko, you freaking thing. What a B word. It must be a little bit deeper out here and there's some fish sitting there because there's two casts in a row. Had some type of action. Got him! Oh, he's right freaking there! What the heck? These are real small fish and they're just not eating it all the way. That'll look cool for you guys, but you guys just think I suck at this point. He's not, he wasn't even hit it hard enough to expose the hook. About ripped it in half though. I gotta channel my inner bass angler and let them actually uh, eat it a little bit longer. Fish on! Come on, buddy, stay on there. Oh, yeah. Look at that cute little guy. Real, real pretty fish. Look at that, guys. He freaking choked the Sanko. But really all my hits today have been on the fall. They're sucking it in. God, he got that freaking hook in him. Real pretty healthy largemouth. That cute little guy. That's actually, get these weeds out of his mouth. This is actually the first fish I've caught since moving to Virginia. So that's my first fish in a quite a while, about a, 13 14 weeks so let's get let this little guy get back in the water oh tried to go on land for a sec and just darted out nice you know it's funny guys is that little bass right there I would have laughed at so many times in my life living in Florida and fishing certain areas. But that little guy right there is more rewarding than a lot of fish I've caught in my life just because it's coming to a new area, fishing somewhere you've never fished before, not really even knowing anything about it, but being able to, through trial and error, kind of figure out something and successfully catch something. So, may not seem like that big of a deal, but to me that is, that's just my first little win of learning how to fish this new area.
God, this area is just freaking gorgeous. I don't know if it, the GoPro gives this place justice, but wow. Truly is beautiful here. Not a whole lot of fish today, but you know, take our small little wins as we go. On my way back now, about done for the uh, hour or so, or two hours that I had for the day to fish. But this is where I got two bites earlier. So I'm gonna make a couple casts, just because you know, I wanna make some footage for you guys, get some footage for you guys. Not because I like wanna catch a fish or anything, who would wanna do that? Ha! Well, my truck's still there, that's good. Oh man, that was a fun little afternoon right there, a little hour and a half of fishing. Despite only catching one little green fish that I had to work pretty hard for, that was a fun afternoon. Just getting out here guys, being in nature, got to see that, that, get, see that doe and her little fawn. Just really just going through the woods in my freaking Waldo outfit. I was pretty one with nature if I do have to say so myself. but. <laughs> All jokes aside, it's uh, it's cool to get into this new fishery. It's it's cool to get out here and learn and be humbled by an entirely new adventure. So, going forward, we got uh, we got some trips that I'm trying to plan out. Um, not there's I'm not just going to be bass fishing every weekend. That's for sure. So, uh, hope you guys are excited as I am going forward. Until that next video. You guys see, I'm out here trying to find my new adventure, so you guys go out there, try and find your new adventure. I'll see you guys in that next video. Thanks for watching.